Hello, I'm Matt. I'm Tom. We're outside. It's still really cold. But hey, that's what we signed up for. What are we talking about today, Tom? Today we are going back on an old video. Oh, yes. Occasionally we are going back on Two Drums and a Cymbal Fall Off Cliff, which is the first YouTube video we ever had that went big. Yeah, thanks. Um, it's actually going to be a card up there. Oh, so. yeah. My so my gloves are about a size too big, so I'm meant to have under gloves, and this is me pointing. You've got talons. I've got, I've got talons. Britain's got talons. That's an owl-based <laughs> reality show, and I love the idea. But they've, they've got a sheep herding one. Oh, they have. So they'll, that'll be next. Yeah. Britain's got talons. That's a great... I kind of want to not, want to not broadcast that now and just kind of send that off to a TV company and see what happens. <laughs> anyway. Yeah. Two drums and cymbal, full of clay. So you must have watched that by now because we gave you a link. Yes. How the hell did that start? Was it still in the pub? Yes. Because it was probably it was still in, in the spoons. pub. It was in Which we previously mentioned. Um, and yeah, we, I mean, I know the dialogue off by heart because I edited it so, far, so much. You've heard the old joke. Two drums are symbol fall off a cliff. <laughs> <laughs> we got two drums. We got a symbol. We got a cliff. cliff. Let's talk about each of those in turn. The, the drums are symbol. Uh, so this is all the lies behind the scenes. Those cost me 99 pence. Didn't you get them off Gumtree or something? I got them off eBay. Got them, someone was selling a child's drum kit. And I get the feeling there was a story there that I never got to hear and he didn't want to tell. Because <laughs> if, you're, if you're buying an entire child's drum kit off someone, what's happened to the child? Are they not interested in drums? It, uh, because no one else bid on the child's drum kit. It was 99 pence. It was the minimum bid. So I, I <laughs> took the train from York to Malton, which is you know, one stop down the line, because it's all oh, right, it's local. Um, gave a man a pound and said <laughs> something along the lines of keep the change. <laughs> and he gave me this child's drum kit that I hold on the train on the way back. <laughs> Barely worth the effort. I don't know what the story was. Um, it felt almost insulting to give him a pound for a child's drunk. It was a kind of a, is the child all right? Has he gotten divorced? Is that I don't know. What, I, I don't want to know. He seemed a little downbeat about it. I hope he never saw that drum kit. Which, he which seemed downbeat for it because he'll have paid at least 20 quid for that thing and you yeah. were giving him one quid for and it. I didn't, and I didn't say what I wanted it for, but it's a student buying a child's drum kit, so it's probably up to some shenanigans. <laughs> but he didn't ask and I didn't tell. What In I, fact, if you've seen this... Was that your drum kit? Yeah. Do you know someone who sold a drum kit to a dodgy-looking student at some point around 2010? <laughs> 2009, 2009, anyway, around Because yeah. um, that was, yeah, that, that was me. We threw it off a cliff. <laughs> Which is and we actually second. did. Now, yeah, we the, actually, the, actually did. The one thing that... Let's talk, let's talk about the cliff first. Okay. Yeah, Yeah. because the actual throw... <laughs> the cliff. The cliff. It was called Richard. Cliff Richard. Crying out. <laughs> <laughs> you found that on the internet somewhere, on like a I list did, of I climbing found... walls or something, wasn't yeah, it? Yeah, it, it was a list of walls or bouldering sites that, that are good in, in Yorkshire. I found that, and I, um, I don't think Google Street View existed then, so I was kind of no. relying on satellite phone people, and oh, right, it'll probably work. But it is technically on private land. Which brings me to a thing, trespass is not illegal in the UK. It is in some circumstances. You can't go into Buckingham Palace or Houses of Parliament or things like that. You can't go into military bases. But as long as you are not causing uh, an obstruction, harm, damage, distress, trespass is legal in the UK. Um, so we just kind of walked onto this, this land that is, is good for bouldering. Apparently they, they go and do that. Right, that's a, that's a big cliff. Hmm. That's a big cliff. And you, you drove us out there. Yeah, we, we, we loaded the kit, a uh, couple of people helping to hold cameras yep. into and the, my car. There was, a, there was a path up to the top of the cliff, which was incredibly lucky. I thought we were going to have to try and scrabble up it somehow. But and it was, the, it was a matter of having to drive along this road and sort of everyone looking out the window to see if there's a... <laughs> uh, it's, it's, it's in one of these fields. Oh, there it yeah. is. Okay. Yeah. Pull up in a lay-by. Climb a gate. <laughs> yeah. Um, what was it like from your perspective? Because... I, I've, I've seen the shots from the top, I know what that was like. Yeah. What was it like standing at the bottom of the cliff? I'm waiting for Tom. I, he's, he's already called, get ready. Huh. And then I hear, ready! <laughs> and I tell the joke. And what I know is that 
there's gonna be shit dropping behind me very soon. And I like I don't know how like symbols are a I said like a lot there, I'm sorry. Uh symbols are a flat thing. Yeah. You know what it's like if you drop a frisbee or a feather, it goes everywhere. No, symbol didn't. <laughs> <laughs> so I was nervous about that, but yes. So we, we did three did takes? I think it was four, because they broke on the fourth take. Oh, okay. But you are further away from the cliff than it appears. Yeah. Because it's a long shot. Long zoomed shot, in, zoomed which... in, telephoto lens yeah. compresses the frame. But on one of the throws, I heard that symbol go past me. It oh, was yeah. it was a similar gonna... sounds like a tennis racket. A... Can I dig it out from somewhere? I'll see if I can find it. Did it work? And it actually worked. Yes, that's not faked. We have not faked it. Despite the YouTube comments, despite the, uh, yeah, like, that was real. That was entirely real. What, people was, are always going to say it's faked, but we didn't. There is one line there, which is the gap between you, between me throwing them and them landing is extended by about two seconds to make it seem like a much bigger cliff yeah. than it is. That's, it makes the joke funnier, but they landed in a budum tish foot. Yes, they did, exactly to time. That, that whoop of joy for me is entirely real. <laughs> so we got the footage, we got the take, we went on the adventure playground nearby at Thorpe Arch. <gasps> yes! Yeah, big, big adventure playground. It's got a zip city on his zip line thing, I like that. Yeah. I never, I, I won't be able to show the, the old photo of this, but I sent the photo of me on that zip line back home to my parents, and they replied with, we've got one of you from that when you're like six. And there is a shot of me in exactly the same pose, with the same kind of gormless grin on my face, on one of those flying fox things when I was about six. Flying fox? Never flying heard fox. that name before. Okay, yeah. yeah. I was about, the, uh, the only reason I think Brits would know it as that is because that's what it was called on Funhouse. Oh, is it? Yeah. Ah. Um, uh, backtrack, backtrack, <laughs> backtrack. Uh, editing. Yes, we didn't fake it. There, there are changes I would make if I were doing that now. I would not do five incredibly slow-mo shots with a camera that didn't really do slow-mo. <laughs> that was unnecessary. <laughs> the pan, pan. <laughs> yeah. It was also not necessary to do my massive thing of credits at the end with lots of flashy particle effects and lone <laughs> particle effects. That was not necessary. <laughs> I would have ended with the standard that worked and probably smashed cut to a, a... But that's the difference between the 2009 internet, 2009 us. And, and, and between 2009 me and 2015 me. 2016 me. 2016. Ah, oh, yeah. We, we do things differently, but you learn. Yeah. And this is the thing, without, without every step along the way, we wouldn't be here. Yeah. I've said this before, there's no re... God, there's no, there's, there's no way I'd, I'd look back on it. If we'd have done this six years ago, it would have been terrible and I'd be embarrassed about it. And 10 years from me, we'll be embarrassed about this. I'm not embarrassed about two drums and a single. That's what I was going to say. I'm not embarrassed about that. That was. I'm proud of that. I'm really, really proud of that. Half-assed effort, we come up with something that worked. Yeah, but That's... it never converted into subscribers because it was a one-off. Yeah. It, it was, oh, it's this, this guy's done this one thing. Does he have any other videos like that? No, he doesn't. <laughs> Is he putting stuff like that regularly? No, no, he's not. <laughs> it's almost like for all those years, YouTube's advice that I ignored about doing stuff regularly was actually right. So that's why we're out here in the cold. Yeah, that's why we're out here in the cold. And that's why we were out there in the not so cold seven, six, many years ago. I'm looking forward to summer. I'd have worn a different T-shirt on that day if I'd have known that many people had seen it. What was your T-shirt? Uh, some blue one. Okay. Just... Yeah, think. <laughs> Down. <laughs> and a siren from France. France. Yeah. I can't beatbox.